I responded to the Pentagon for 9-11. I responded to Lord Mahan. I responded to the Pentagon crash site. And it was just a normal day. It was a beautiful morning, actually. As far as all we knew, it was just, just came out of nowhere. My phone just starts ringing. Uh, my uh, next door neighbor, he uh, gave me a call and said, hey, a plane just hit one of the Twin Towers. We had the radio on, the police band, and we heard this cop screaming. I had a job to do. You know, it wasn't, it wasn't the time for me to ask questions and have doubt. I had a responsibility. Everything in the pile was a mishmash of melted office telephones and luggage and shredded clothes and people's certificates of achievement. Well, there were officers and firemen who went in that building to rescue people who they didn't know, who they'd never met before. They were able to get some out, but ultimately they never made it home. You can't forget it. I mean, you want to forget it, but you can't. It got to the point where, you know, when I would, you know, we'd work a full day there, and when we get back, you know, I would dream about it. So it was kind of like I was constantly there. But it's something that you still think of. I mean, for my generation, it was our Pearl Harbor. It was our Vietnam. It was our moment that I don't think anybody will forget. Most people do remember and don't forget, and that makes me feel better. I hope that the things that I found in the pile brought peace to someone, that maybe a family member or somebody who worked in that building, their family, may have something to remember them by. And it's what I, why I do what I do. It's why I've been in law enforcement almost my whole life, is to help. As the sheriff of Hillsborough County, I'm proud to say these heroes are part of this team, and we are honored to have them. We recognize the job that was done on 9-11. We appreciate those that were on the front lines, and we remember the lives we lost.